Hello everyone, Putin Tech Talk here, and today we're going to be doing an unboxing video for the iPhone 7 Plus Jet Black. And this is the 128 gig version, I believe. Uh, box looks kosher to me, same in the back front. Uh, let's get it open. So upon opening the box, you notice that it's a pretty well built, sturdy box. Um, but upon further inspection, you notice that it's actually matte. The box itself is matte. I kind of feel ripped off that it's not the same jet black color. Pulling the box apart, you notice that famous suction, which means the box was meticulously crafted by Apple engineers. Looking at the pamphlet, we see that it's pretty much standard instructions in the front. Uh, Apple stickers in the back. Make sure to put these on your minivan. Picking up the 7 Plus, you notice that nothing really has changed except the fact that there's no more headphone jack and the antenna bands are gone. Put this aside for a bit. Moving on to the charger, we have Apple's original underpowered block. It is absolutely trash. Go to Amazon and get yourself a 2.4 amp charger. You will thank me, I promise you. As for this little dude, just throw him away. Now the headphone part was a, a real letdown actually because I was hoping for some wireless buds but instead they give you this adapter. Thank you, but no thank you. Last but not least, we got the cable, also trash. And of course, double check the box, always. Back to the iPhone, you can definitely spot some notable differences but nothing out of the ordinary about the same size and dimensions all around looking at the back of the phone they have finally removed the trademarks making the phone that much cleaner now for the most notable feature of the 7 plus it would have to be the dual lens setup right here with the right lens being a wide lens and the left lens being a 50 millimeter telephoto i will be doing a in-depth review of the camera in my next video Okay, so you can literally use this phone as a mirror. Like, that's how reflective this phone is. Let's try to leave a fingerprint right here. Surprisingly not that noticeable. Okay, that's much better. So yeah, this phone is definitely a fingerprint magnet. And that will conclude this unboxing video. If you guys liked the video, like it. If you didn't, don't. Um, subscribe to see more. Bye-bye.